the people of Pittsburgh, Kansas, the county, Crawford County, puts their arms around all of the Baja teams. Pittsburgh is so small that we make it a, uh, an entire town event. Uh, with the Bajas on Broadway, we get the community involved. We ask the teams uh, voluntarily to come out, bring their trailers, bring their vehicles, and we close down Broadway. Basically, that's why it's called Bajas on Broadway. And we had basically a party. We had live bands, we had foods, we had vendors. You know, hundreds if not more people came out and visited all of these Baja vehicles. The students, the teams really loved communicating and, and telling the story about how their Baja was created. We set up the course for spectators and really just make it an event for the whole town as well as, as the competitors. Sure, we had some inclement weather yesterday, which put a hinder on the dynamic day. Unfortunately, it was just too wet uh, for safety-wise to complete after the, the rainstorm and the thunderstorm came through. But ultimately, the cars that were prepared, they got all their runs in. It should be a lesson, I guess, to, to students that you need to be, you need to come here prepared and not still working on the cars. It was a tough race. Uh, at the start, there was a ton of mud. Car filled up very quickly. At the first fuel stop, we were just scooping the mud out. Could feel the difference once we got back out on the track. It was definitely weighing us down. There was a lot of drop off. Just knowing the car and uh, knowing the impacts and loads that it can take and making sure that I take it set, slow and steady throughout the entire race and uh, get through it without braking. It was a cool event. It was cool to see all the teams out there and uh, how much support there is for Baja in this community. The students that come to these events, they're all professional and it just was a really good time. Um, like I said, we enjoy doing it. It's a community-wide effort though. I mean, it's not, we literally have hundreds of volunteers that have, have put hours into this over the course of, you know, the planning and, and then obviously the, the overall events. Okay.